Hello everybody, Mobius1 here, bringing you the next episode of Star Wars TIE Fighter. We are continuing our Tour 1, Battle 1, which is the Aftermath of Hoth, and let's check out our briefing. Alright, so, Aftermath of Hoth, number 2, red alert. This is three TIE Fighters from Alpha, Beta, and Gamma Squadrons will patrol the area around the station. Your weapon arming crew has added concussion missiles to your TIE Fighter for more firepower. Okay. All TIE Fighters will destroy any incoming enemy ships before they can destroy our station. So it sounds like we're basically doing a protect the station mission. Assume any trouble will come from the direction of buoy 18 where we stopped the smuggled rebel cargo. Okay. That should be it, right? Oh. Our forces must survive until the Imperial Star Destroyer Hammer arrives to relieve us. Alright. That's it. So let's talk to our flight officer. What are the mission objecti objectives? After interrogating the rebel prisoners we captured aboard the M Mugari freighter, we are sure that the Rebels plan to launch an assault on this outpost. You must hold off the attacking forces until help arrives from the Imperial Star Destroyer Hammer. What craft will I be flying? You will be flying the TIE Fighter designated Alpha-1. You will have two wingmen. Your TIE Fighter will be specifically modified to carry two concussion missile launchers holding two missiles each. Uh, we expect the Mugari and the Rebels to be joining forces to attack us. It is likely that they will only have the more obsolete starfighters, like the Z-95 Headhunter and the Y-Wing, to use in this assault. However, they may use the more advanced fighters like the X-Wing as well. Okay. And this time, we actually have, uh, this back door is actually open. It says we can talk, talk to Cloaked Figure. So the Cloaked Figure offers us bonus objectives. It says, how may I serve the Emperor? I am a special envoy of the Emperor. In this time of crisis, uh, political intrigue, and open rebellion, the Emperor requires special means of communication with his loyal forces. In the battles ahead, I will ensure that, he wi that his wishes reach those like yourself who have pledged their, f their fealty to him. You will have many opportunities to serve the Emperor and will be rewarded for your efforts. In the mission ahead, locate the rebel officers who are fleeing from Hoth in a stolen Imperial shuttle. We have forces standing by who will attempt to disable and capture this shuttle once you have located it. Alright. So we do have a bonus objective there. And this is what's cool about TIE Fighter, and you don't get this option in X-Wing. Um, which is one of the reasons why TIE Fighter kicks X-Wing's ass. You actually get to, in these Tour of Duty missions, once you're flying a craft that's equipped with missile launchers, you actually get to select what type of munitions you want to go into battle with. And these options will change the further into the story we get. So, uh, what these numbers here mean, blast rating of, of uh, 30, so this is how strong it is. Exit velocity, so this is how fast it travels and how, uh, excuse me, how long, homes for up to 30 seconds, how long that missile is actually going to survive uh, before it destroys itself. So if we compare the concussion missile to a proton torpedo, the uh, the torpedo does 100 damage while the, the missile only does 30. However, the missile travels at a speed of 240, where the torpedo is only 120. So the torpedo is mainly used for like bombing runs, whereas the missile is used for anti-starfighter. We then have the option of using a heavy bomb or a rocket. These are really only used for taking out large structures like space platforms or capital ships, um, because you can only carry very few of these. I guarantee you if we were to go with like a heavy bomb, we'd only be able to carry one per launcher instead of two like with the, uh, the missile. So we're just going to go with the missile and see what happens. So here we go. Alright, so we're outside the platform. We'll do a quick check and see what's around. Oh god, we're getting... Y-wings are coming in out of hyperspace already. This is Beta and Gamma Squadrons engaging enemy forces. Five new Y-wings. Okay. We, uh, we need to get out there, so I'm gonna dump some of my laser energy into my... Oh wait, he's not that far. 
Why is close enough? We'll get these lasers back. Alpha one, this is Blake. Alpha using your target for attack. See how it works. That did pretty good. Excellent hunting, Alpha One. Wow, things are getting pretty intense already. A torpedo. Get it! Did I get it? Yes! Sniped that torpedo right out of the sky. Alpha one. Mission critical installation under attack. Let's check how's that station doing. 92% hull, so alright, we did good. Oh boy, they do have X-wings. Order acknowledged, sir. Using your target for attack. Alright, let's see. He's setting up for an attack run on the platform. So we need to we need to get out there and interrupt his attack run before he launches some torpedoes. Or we'll just kill him in one run, Jesus. Look at that! We're quite a ways out from home. If enemy forces ex exit hyperspace on the other side of the station right now, we'd be in trouble. So... We don't want to get too far. It is nice to be right here where, they're, where they seem to be coming out of hyperspace, because then we can intercept them real quick, but if they're... If their entry point changes, we're gonna we're gonna have a problem. You notice the music got real calm. Three X wings, they're coming in behind us still, that's good. Target, the platform, one's attacking Alpha 2, the other two are attacking Alpha 2. Alright, so which one? Blue 1 is attacking the platform. Acknowledged. Alpha 1, using your target for attack. So I'll send my wingman on him, I'll also set up a missile. We'll do a missile strike. And that took him off his attack plan real quick, and then I'm gonna break off. I'm going to go for the other two X-Wings. Just because I don't want them to take out my Wingman. Oh wow. I'm surprised that didn't kill me. Oh crap. What just came in? There's the shuttle. Shuttle guts. I'm going to... Keep my wingmen going after them. This is Blake Group Alpha using your target for attack. Well, we have to. We'll go inspect this shuttle because this is probably that officer that's trying to flee Hoth. So we dumped all power to engines. I don't want to shoot at it because I don't know exactly what it is, but let's see. Good work, yep. Alpha One. 
Secondary mission objectives completed. The Emperor will be pleased. So assault gunboats have been dispatched. I don't want to shoot at this because I, I think the if the gunboats do missile runs on it, which I think they will, they'll actually end up destroying it instead of disabling it, and I don't want that to happen. So I'll, I'll fly nearby and we'll see what happens. Good, those gunboats are right there. Yeah, see, they did. Perfect. See, if I had started weakening its shields before those gunboats came in, those missiles would have destroyed it. Are you serious? You guys didn't land a single hit with all that fire? Alpha 1, this is U1. Target disabled. Nice. Gotcha. Alright, I want to link up with my wingmen again. I mean, here comes Transport S uh, S Epsilon 2. Is bringing troopers out from the station to board the shuttle. And here come two Y wings. Radio message received, Alpha 1, using your target for attack. And both Y wings are doing attack runs on the platform, so they're not going to engage us. Percent hull? Are you kidding me? What? Oh, he made it into hyperspace. Damn. See, I don't think, I don't think enemy starfighters actually flee the battle on easy because I do not remember that happening when I was younger. So I think maybe the fact that I'm playing on medium, the uh, enemy starfighters actually bug out when they get damaged enough. Superb work, Alpha 1. Primary objectives completed. The Emperor will be pleased. Star Destroyer's here? Hey, it is. Star Destroyer Hammer has arrived. Let's check out our objectives and see. Shuttle Scuts was inspected. Let's wait and see what happens when the transport actually captures the shuttle. Three Corellian Corvettes. That could be a problem. What do they want? They can't launch fighters. Three TIE Bombers coming in to take their take care of those. What could they possibly want? I don't want to get too close to those. Those things will rip me up to pieces. Yeah, they're actually yelling at me in chat. Alpha One, return to the hammers dock or hangar bay immediately. No, are they? What are they shooting at? Are they shooting at me? Or are they shooting at the shuttle? Oh, they're shooting at the gunboats. Yeah, look at all those lasers. If I get too close, these guys will rip me up. Commence capture operation. This is Mew 2. Target destroyed. Capture operation complete. Oh god! Ooh, 
that was close. Oh no, we lost a wingman. Alright, where's that transport? Target destroyed. It's hypering. Did we oh we captured the shuttle? We did capture the shuttle. Was that a bonus objective? It was a bonus objective. So we do have more bonus objectives. I bet you taking these bastards out would be it. It's the last one. This is the last one. Alpha One, target Done. destroyed. Excellent work, Alpha One. Secret mission objective. That was it. There we go. Bonus mission objectives completed. And now we get to go back. Uh, instead of docking with the platform, we have to dock with the Star Destroyer. So, looks like we're moving on up in the in the world of the Imperial Navy. Let's see, yeah. A TIE Fighter, man. There's some, there's some high res polygons right there. Looks like we lost both of our wingmen, though. Oh well. Let's do a victory flyby, shall we? Permission to buzz the tower. in underneath. Seriously, <laughs> one of the assault gunboats just crashed into it. Oh, that's so bad. Alright. Spacebar takes us in. We get to review. Mission was a success. You have defeated an attack by the rebels and Mugari. You have saved our outpost from destruction and destroyed many of the attacking enemy ships. All goals completed. Let's see, I killed three X-Wings, five Y-Wings, and I didn't kill any of the Corvettes, damn. Only the, uh, only the final shot counts for these. We lost five TIE Fighters, damn. But that's not bad considering what we took out, I mean, Jesus. Five TIE Fighters compared to three Corvettes? That's worth it. And we captured a shuttle with the officers. So, look at him, he's happy. Let's talk to Mr. Cloaked Figure. The rebel officers you have located will prove useful to our cause. From them we will learn the whereabouts of other rebel terrorists. Alright, he tells me the same thing, right? Yeah. And look, look, he looks just as happy, doesn't he? Look at that smile, you can see he's smiling under there. But that's it. Alright, hope you guys thought this episode was interesting. And we'll see you next time.